What's going on guys? It's CV Sukiomi and um I've been getting a lot of requests because like I guess my anime card sleeve video really did spawn like a lot of requests to do these kind of product reviews because I don't really do um too many product reviews like last time I did it on um like uh Last time I did it on my anime card sleeves, and people really like that video. So basically, I'm going to do another video. I did it in the past, but I actually deleted it because I want to do a proper version of it. Um, I'm going to do a review on an anime double deck box. Um, these are really, really um, neat. The quality is really high. Basically, for those of you guys who don't know, it's a deck box times two. Um, the quality is the same as a lot of the other anime deck boxes. Um which is like basically standard. Um, if you have a Cardfight Vanguard single deck box, the quality is basically like that. Um, but yeah, so basically I'm gonna do a review on this so you guys know. So basically, um, I'm gonna use this because I used to use this a lot, but now I don't. This is a single, a single deck box. And um, basically like it's pretty good, holds a lot of stuff inside, it can. But a single slide, a single sleeve deck, it holds one with um, extra room to put extra cards. So pretty nice. But if you double sleeve, um, it actually only holds room to hold one. And I don't have any decks double sleeved, but just take my word for it. If you have a double sleeve deck, basically it will fit like one with like almost like very little room left over. So it's nice to have. Now... Basically, a double deck box is like two of these, so pretty cool. I use one. Um, I will tell you at the end of the video where you can go to pick some of this stuff up. So, if you guys are interested. Basically, this is... Uh, uh, I think this is Bakamono Gatari. Ba um, I don't, basically, if you guys don't know, it's like a... It's like a vampire anime, kind of, but um, it's got twist to it. So, And this is not a uh, Nadiko... Um, which is the snake in the anime. She's really cute. And I like the color of the box, which is why I bought it. But I also have... Well... I'm not really in a position to go get it right now. But I also have Hitagi, the crab. But I don't want to go get that because I, I haven't even opened it yet. But um, basically this box holds a large compartment with two other small boxes inside. So... This is the outer shell, and then inside the shell you get these two other um, boxes that come with these. I guess these are like covers, so these are pretty nifty. I don't know what they say, but that's besides the point. Still good quality, and it comes with one divider. I just use a different divider. I also use a Carfight Vanguard Phantom Blaster Dragon one. Um, probably going to change this out for a different one, but I like this one too. So Now... These are the things that go inside your outer shell. Now, it's the same size as this regular one, maybe a little bit bigger. So you know that a single sleeve deck is going to fit with uh, room, with room to spare. Now, I actually think I can fit two. Let me try this really quick. I don't know if I can fit two, but if I can, basically that means if you have four single sleeve decks, you can fit four inside here. So cool beans for you. Oh, cool. Actually, it does fit. Um, yeah, I basically got two of my decks in there. My Gold Paladin deck and my Swipe Brother deck. So basically, both of these compartments can hold two single sleeve decks. So you can hold four decks single sleeve, and you can hold, um... You can hold, uh, two double sleeve decks. So pretty nice. One second here. The divider's pretty cute, too. It's, uh, the monkey. The basketball player let me well, hold on one second i'm gonna try something really quick off top off cue on the video but um i really actually want to try this give me one second here i want to see if the regular single single deck box like this one can fit too because it doesn't look like it and if that's the case then that means these outer shells are bigger than bigger than this single one so i don't think this thing can fit too so there's a garmor paladins for those of you guys who don't know no there's no way this thing's gonna fit too. So ba okay. So basically, one second here. All right. 
These outer shells are bigger than the single size deck box. So you can hold a lot of stuff in here. I really like using these specific deck boxes because, um, one, they're really nifty. Like, they're really unique. A lot of people don't carry these kind of deck boxes. So it's really nice to have. Like, it kind of stands out if you want to be one of those people. And if you really like anime, it's also really nice to have. Um, when I go to Japan, I'll probably pick up more of these. So which won't be until next year. But besides the point, I will probably pick up more of these. And yeah, it's got Velcro on the bottom, but it's pretty good. I just like the color, the, the, the texture, the design, the image quality is like really good. And um, so basically you can fit four, um, four single sleeve decks, or you can fit two double sleeve decks. So yeah, basically pretty good. For anyone who doesn't know, I switched to Kron as my starting Vanguard. It actually works out really, really good. So, um, Besides the point, this was my anime double deck box review. It's um, super good quality. It's basically the same. Um, it holds a lot. Good storage. Basically, you can buy these kind of deck boxes at the hobby search I did. The hobby search, the the website I offered in the anime card sleeve one, but there are a few others like OdaQ. Um, there's a few other ones. I'll put the links down below. You can also get some in, I, I think you can get some on Amazon. I don't know, but um, maybe eBay. I'm not sure, but basically it's a good place. Now they don't make a lot of these like they really don't. So basically really good to um, at least get one if you're a big anime fan and you want to have a bigger box. Uh, it's good to get one, in my opinion, because they actually don't make a lot of these. So they don't just like constantly produce these double deck boxes. A lot of companies just produce these single ones. So um, the double deck boxes um, are more hard to get and they're more expensive. General price range is probably 30 to $50, depending on which one you want. There's one that I want, like this one I think cost me, when I got it, I think a year ago, it was about... $30. Now, if you buy it new, I still think it's about $35, $36. There's one I have. It's the um, Bakamono Gadari uh, Hitagi Senjohara. I think that's her name. That deck, double deck box is like blue with Hitagi here, the crab. That one's like 50 bucks. So that one's, I'm not, I don't actually plan on um, unsealing because that one has a lot of value to it. But there is a few other ones I'm looking for. So if anyone is selling them, let me know because I am looking for um, the Nagisa clan ad one because that one's very good looking uh, and Nagisa is a very sentimental character to me. And if you so if you guys have that or just double deck boxes in general, let me know. Um, so send me a message or something and I'll probably take it off your hands depending on what you have. So but yeah, that's my anime double deck box review. Uh, not sure what else that I can review on it. Um, because really like it's just one outer shell, two other boxes in the inside. And that's basically it. So I don't really know what else to tell you. Uh, but yeah, that's my video, guys. Um, so if you guys like more of these product reviews, just let me know and I'll do more of them. If you guys have something that you want me to review that I haven't reviewed yet because a lot of people are really interested in these anime stuff. If, I, if there's something besides a box or like a um, sleeve that I don't know about, or if there's something you want me to review that I'm not sure about, just let me know and I'll see what I can do. So thanks guys for watching. Peace out.